ledge hopping. On it. <laughs> I love uh, when we start out an episode that way. You mean huh? every time? <laughs> Basically. So yes, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. It's Boss Rush. Icicles hate me. And so does the ground when you're falling, you know, Where? when you approach it fast. Oh, wait. <laughs> 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 it, it. Do I have to do this again? I have to do this again. Crab. Crab nuggets. I forget what happened, but, like, did I fall or something? I fell. Maybe? Mayhaps. Or maybe you just went a weird route that you weren't supposed to go. Uh, possibly. Oh, I think you dropped down that elevator room when you didn't have a way of getting back up. That's what it I was, what yeah. Happened. Yeah. I'm a doctor. I know how to diagnose these things. That's a lie. <laughs> I'm not a doctor. However, I do know how to diagnose these things. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we did, in the last episode, promise something. Did we? Oh the, yeah, yeah, we did. So, all right, what's another? What's another good Man. song name from from the great band that is Men with Lady Parts? Oh, I've got one for you. Oh yes. Do you remember a uh, a specific ballad? Oh. Yeah. Oh my! This it, it, it tells the tale of a of a man. Of a hero, I hear. A true hero. A true hero among heroes. Some call him a vigilante. Some a nightmare. But the people who <laughs> some knew him a nightmare. <laughs> the best <laughs> called him Orphan Fist. They did. The Ballad of the Orphan ballad Fist. The Ballad of Orphan Fist is <laughs> by Men with Lady by Parts. Men's it's one of the best songs out there at is, oh, shoot. In, at the market in this time. I hear. Um, you can buy it, uh, <laughs> just, you can't, it doesn't exist. Um, oh, look at this old man! We need the bow for you this need to... garbage. I hate that I can't just move my hands to aim. This is another one of those, like, times where you come into this place, this is obviously, like, the place he worships or whatever, and you're just, like, you waltz in, and he's, like, I'm, I have to kill this kid, because <laughs> he's in my, in my, in my biz. And you just, well, he's not even like that at first. You just start shooting him with arrows. It's its not the nicest thing you can do. You know? But I guess, Shoot. I guess this uh, great hero is just not that nice of a kid. Dang it. <laughs> hey, look, I am going to say he attacked me first, so, you know. Did he? <laughs> he did, actually. He came at me, bro. <laughs> oh, perhaps he shouldn't have done that. I you are gonna swear. just mm, you're gonna die. I disagree, sir. We'll find out next time. <laughs> this is like two minutes in. <laughs> wow, these episodes just get shorter and shorter. Shorter and shorter until I forget to turn the to, the, the, the timer on, and then there. Five more minutes than they should be. <laughs> Fire arrows. Yeah, Man, I feel like it just turned time. into, like... Shoot, who's that actor? He played uh, BoJack Horseman and, and Lego Batman. Will Arnett. Will Arnett. Uh, it just turned into Will Arnett for a second there. What do you mean? That that voice. Oh, okay. It's like, wow, these episodes just get shorter and shorter. <sighs> oh, man. Lego Batman. That was a... That, that was, was a, a good movie. Surprisingly good movie. That fight scene, like the fight sequence where they went out and started fighting everything, just that was awesome. gave me some good, good feels. I love those movies. They're they're too good. They're not supposed to. They shouldn't be good. <laughs> oh man. I will watch those films till the day I die. Yeah, yeah. I'll have to like. I don't know which one was my favorite. I feel like I might have even liked Lego Batman more than... Than the first Lego movie? Than Lego movie, yeah. I might be with you on that. I'm torn. I love both of them so much. Yeah, yeah. Um, shoot, I mean, we where... did we did make... What do... A bunk couch because that movie... Yeah, we made the double-decker couch. Yeah, we made we, the double-decker couch. We actually couch do have a... We're sitting on we're it right sitting now. We're sitting on it right now. <laughs> that's, we, that's where we've it. been recording all of our yeah. Boss Rush episodes has been on our double-decker couch. Which, I mean, I couldn't I couldn't sleep in these horrible dorms without a uh, proper double-decker couch. So everyone can be comfortable and be buddies. Yeah. 
The only thing we're missing is the coolers. We do need we do need coolers and we need uh, well we have the cup holders. We have cup holders, yeah. <laughs> but they're more phone holders than they are cup holders. We we do yeah, yeah that's like um, all we use them for. Like um, charging places. One thing I did find kind of disappointing about the temples in Majora's Mask, and I understand it from the standpoint of there are only four temples. Yeah. So they can't all be filled with, I don't know. Um, so, like, all the, like, really cool stuff is going to be found elsewhere. Yeah, totally. But, like, uh, normally you get, like, a, a new special item uh, in, in a dungeon, right? Yeah. In Majora's Mask, you always get something bow-related. You get the bow in oh. the forest temple. In the next temple, you get the fire arrows. In the next temple, you get the ice arrows. In the next temple, you get the, uh, the, I think it's the light arrows. Oh. Is um, there no hookshot in this game, or do you get There it? is a hookshot, oh, but you, you get it. Oh, you got it already, didn't you, you? No, 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 you get it in the Pirate Fortress. Oh, okay, yeah. Um, um, spoilers. <laughs> I wish, first of all, there's no Pirate Forces he, Fortress, he was lying. Um, <laughs> they'll be surprised later. <laughs> Tell me you're surprised. <laughs> Pretend it's like Christmas. But, like, I wish that there was a hookshot mask instead. <laughs> <laughs> he's just got this big just, spike on his face well uh, you, i'm sorry you mean his nose like the giant polygon they gave a, I him mean, for yeah. a nose it would be like the bomb mask except way better he just shoots his nose out and stuff it sticks into the wall and you just see him go by yeah, and, like face first that would be so awesome but they didn't do that nintendo nintendo you disappoint nintendo if you're listening <laughs> <laughs> which we know you are i have uh copyrighted copyrighted that uh that idea as of right now well you can't copyright an uh, idea but you can't patent it i copyrighted it when I okay copyrighted. <laughs> you copyrighted it buddy um <laughs> uh, and uh you know what there's uh you can buy it from me if you want <laughs> for a uh for a, a large sum a small sum <laughs> a small loan of a million dollars a small <laughs> oh, my oh God. dear <laughs> uh life is <sighs> Life is good <laughs> Life when is you're right. a, when you're a ninja block. What? When you're a ninja, was that what it was? What are you talking about? You're obviously not among sophisticated people. I mean, no, but what are you talking about? I'll show it to you later. All right. Okay. So I, it was like uh, I think it was during a Nintendo Direct, and Nintendo was advertising something. It was like Ninja Black or something. That sounds stupid. Um, was it stupid? It looked pretty dumb. Okay, uh, cool. And uh, the the guy on there, I can't remember the exact words, but it was something to the effect of, life's good when you're a Ninja Block. And I'm just sitting there like, hey, you're an idiot. <laughs> it's like Jim Sterling uses that clip all the time when he's oh. making fun of um, just anybody. It doesn't even have to be Nintendo. Yeah. Um, but he'll also like... Uh, he'll use this clip from... They were advertising an Animal Crossing game. And he's like... Here's a TV that looks like an apple. <laughs> what? <laughs> I gotta show you some of this stuff. That sounds ridiculous. I've, I've watched a few Nintendo Directs, not a lot of them. They've gotten um, so much better than when they started out. Are you sure? Because last one that I watched, the translator. <laughs> well, that didn't. was... Uh, they actually ended up commending that translator because they were like, we did not give you... Uh, these people went off script a lot. And, um, oh, okay. And uh, you actually did a pretty, pretty good job, all things considered. So they were really chill okay. with that poor guy. That's cool. Um, um, it was pretty funny to listen to, I'll be honest. Like, I, I still, I was so excited that entire night. Oh, yeah, because that was the time that Breath of the Wild came out. Well, that was our first, right? like, it, like we had seen the Switch. Oh, that was the full-on um, showcase. Of the yeah, Switch. that was when they were telling yeah. us like everything that was actually coming yeah. out they were for like, it. <laughs> we got one, two Switch. Get and, hype. And arms. <laughs> and arms. Yeah, arms looks. I still haven't even seen that much from it. I have it. I I still haven't seen that much. Dude, from we gotta it. do two player on that. Sometime. Oh man, is there two player on that? There game? is two player I guess there on would that. Have to be. And I've got like four Joy Cons. I would get. So. It destroyed i enjoy fighting games but boy let me tell you what unless i've put some time into it boy let me tell you what no, let me tell you what. what 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 i really don't like that i'll be honest um king of the hill is uh huh. that's a show oh is that what it's from yeah king of the hill i haven't uh, watched king of the hill 
It's a. I've seen very few episodes from it. I've yeah. always enjoyed what I've seen. It's, it's a. It's a weird show. It seems it's, like very like niche comedy. Yeah, it's you know? it's super chill. I, I like yeah. that the most about it. It's it just gives off a good vibe. I feel like it's relatable for kind of the demographic that it's, yeah. it's from. It's not like that's as kind of the idea. It's not as outlandish as something like uh, South Park or Family Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and uh, like I get real tired of. Family Guy, because Family oh, Guy is so much. Yeah. It's just the shock humor, and yeah, it's me the. Too. Um, I I always actually liked American Dad a bit more. I actually haven't watched that one. Amer- I, like yeah. none of these I've watched. I've watched like parts of some of them. Um, I don't know. Just like the majority of those don't really catch my attention. Yeah, much, yeah, which I can know? understand. Um, yeah. Shoot. Nice. Yeah! I... You can't punch that high. You know what I might be able to do? This is gonna be reckless. Are you just trying... That's awesome. (laughs) Yeah! (laughs) I want to know what the real way you're supposed to do for that. I forget. I completely, entirely forget. You know what? I think you're supposed to use bombs, and I never got them because I have the bomb mask. <laughs> and you are the bomb. I, bro. Oh, never. I didn't mean that. I meant literally. <laughs> uh, oh. <laughs> you are a bomb. Oh. <laughs> um. You s- just strapped a bomb to your face. Come, come to me, my child. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. I just don't. From behind, it's kind of like. Yeah, cool. when it looks almost like yeah. you're a Tokyo Ghoul character, where it's just the tendrils coming out of your head, and then you turn around and then looks you see like... the face. It's, uh, it's it's hideous, is what it is. I just um, <laughs> I forgot those pots do that. Man, sometimes pot does. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when the pot hits you, like. <laughs> <the> pot hit. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> Yeah, I think I told the story about, like, the one time in my life where what? I've seen illegal drugs. Oh, <laughs> illegal drugs? Uh, was when, uh, I got a pair of pants from Plato's Closet. What are you... Uh, I was a teenager. Oh, yeah. And I got a pair of pants from Plato's Closet, which is, like, it's a used clothes store. Okay, so um, it's where drug dealers go. I guess, and <laughs> somebody either didn't like they didn't check or, or they forgot or like but you know that tiny little pocket wait you, that's in your right pocket <laughs> whoa wait did you just buy free drugs from the store it, it, they were in the pocket when i got home all right but like <laughs> but did you uh yes did you <laughs> what were they like what was it marijuana Oh, it was just some marijuanas. Are you sure it wasn't just the lint? <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> no. Like... like it was in a bag. Oh, perfect. Like it was in a little baggie perfect. in that in the in the baby pocket that's in your normal pocket. Man, your teenage years, you could have just made some quick cash at school. <laughs> like, I, I was home school. You could have made some quick cash at school, Wayne. To be fair, Cora was with me at the time. What does this mean? <laughs> Do you mean you could have sold it to her, or...? Uh, probably. Okay. <laughs> uh, no, actually what we ended up doing was we just flushed it down the toilet. Oh, because you were scared of trying new things like your parents always told you to. My parents are always, always have been when I was, a uh, much younger. Um, on my back about trying new things, because I was one of those super picky kids. I, I... <laughs> Man, if I was... Because I, I was never the kind of kid to do drugs yeah. either. Like, I, I don't know. For one, I, like, I don't know what it was because I was definitely not the best kid at school. I got good grades, but that didn't mean I was a good person. Yeah. Um, But, like, I was never around them. I don't know how or why. Yeah, that was me. It was no. like, I never really took up an interest in yeah. drugs or alcohol or anything uh, growing up. So by the time I was old enough to drink, yeah. I still don't drink much. Uh, like, shoot, I'm turning 24 later this year. Huh. And the most I've ever had in terms of a drink is like a hard cider yeah. that I like to have on yeah. occasion. 
Um, I mean, I don't, I don't mind the idea, you know, like, yeah, when, if it becomes legal in the whole U.S., which I'm pretty sure it will sometime soon, um, I'm sure I'll take a shot, you know, because, like, at this point, I'm, I'm, you know, at the age where I'm starting to have to go out and, like, do internships and look for like a career job so you want to be high no what i'm saying <laughs> is that i don't when want to go to an interview <laughs> i'm saying that i don't you want to be stoned <laughs> i want to just be out like of peasants. my mind i want to be thinking that there are like three interviewers i just want to stop falling off of this <laughs> i think the fix to that look within yourself uh -huh. And, uh, get good. God. What are you doing? I keep trying to readjust myself, and he just keeps jumping off. Just, like, don't try to readjust yourself. Just let it be, you know? Just relax. And I find yeah, myself in what I mean is, like, I don't, trouble. I don't want to, uh... Nemo, no screws with me. I don't want to end up, now that I'm getting into, you know, getting jobs and stuff like that. I hate like, this freaking temple. Where's the No, I don't I don't wanna be doing that while it's illegal. Actually know? I stole that joke from MC when Profit. It's not illegal. Don't steal the jokes. <laughs> don't do that. Oh, okay, we it's had to bring the illegal. pillar back. Yeah. So we're gonna go smashing it back around in the next episode of Boss Rush. Yeah. <sighs> Punch! Falcon! <laughs> it kinda does have that. He does. Fire he's got, like he's got the wind up fists. to it. Yeah. They should just give the Goron point to sunglasses. Yeah. Or I guess Captain Falcon just has pointy eyes. <laughs> I don't know. All right. Huh. 